What is up, you guys? I'm Charmix, and today I'm going to be reacting to SMA Movie Alien Jeffy by Supervisor Logan. Now, I don't... I don't know. The title suggests that Jeffy becomes an alien. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, anyway, I hope this will be quite funny. The original link's in the description. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Super Bowser Logan without any further ado. Let's begin. Hey, Daddy Scoot over. What, why? To make room for Mr. Hippo. What, no, Mr. Hippo. Yes, Mr. Hippo. Jeffy, Mr. Hippo's huge. He's taking up the whole couch. That's what I was gonna say. It's freaking massive. Me and Mr. Hippo wanna watch TV. But, Jeffy, I was watching TV. But me and Mr. Hippo wanna watch Animal Planet. No, Jeffy, I was watching TV. <laughs> What, Jeffy, stop it, stop it, stop it. Daddy, if you don't turn on Animal Planet, then me and Mr. Hippo are going to keep going. Oh, okay, fine, I'll turn on Animal Planet. <sighs> or not. Breaking news, okay? World-renowned scientist, Dr. Frederick Finkelsheets, has an exclusive interview with an alien inside Area 51. Let's go to that now. Hello, I am Dr. Frederick Finkelsheets, and today, I noticed they changed his name a little bit. Probably gonna slip to Cedric because it still sounds like the S word, but it's like bed sheet. <laughs> now that's what he, they changed it to instead of the actual S word. I don't know. Bring me. Well, I have an exclusive interview with a real alien. Now this alien crash landed 72 years ago in Roswell, New Mexico, in 1947. Now tell us, alien, where are you from? Oh, yes, I see. He is from the West Side. <laughs> That's so stupid. Yes, yes, quite. Now, alien, tell us what happened that night that caused you to crash your spaceship. I see. Yes, yes, you were driving your spaceship. Yes, and you, you were spanking someone. Yes, and then it, it was a bumpy ride. No, not a, not a bumpy. I, I, it was a fun time. Uh, uh, your, your seat was very bouncy. No. Hmm, okay. You, you are doing pull-ups. Yes, not pull-ups. Hmm. You're doing something. You, you, are, you are Or someone. Thing, clap, clapping? Yes, you are clapping something. What were you clapping? You are clapping a alien cheeks. Yes, you, we were clapping alien cheeks. You heard it here first, folks. This alien crashed his spaceship in Roswell because he was clapping <laughs> alien cheeks. Now, some of you may be worried that this dangerous alien might- This is a groundbreaking interview. <laughs> escape, but do not worry. He can't escape because he is handcuffed. Show them. Oh no. The has cut off. Wait, I'm getting word now that the alien has escaped Area 51 and the police are searching for him now. They're telling us that he's extremely dangerous and we should all remain indoors. If you see something, don't hesitate to call 911 immediately. Oh no, an alien escaped. Jeffy, that alien could try to clap our cheeks. Should we hide Mr. Hippo? Because Mr. Hippo got that wagon. Oh man, Jeffy, Mr. <laughs> Hippo is dummy thick. Should probably turn around before I act up. All right. What am I watching? <laughs> this is a funny episode so far. Daddy. I'm thinking about it now. Area 51 is pretty far away from Florida, so we don't have to really worry about the alien. Daddy, me and Mr. Hippo are hungry. Can you order us a pizza? Jeffy, hippos don't eat pizza. Hippos need to eat something they find in the wild, like green beans. Daddy, where is the hippo going to find a can of green beans in the wild? It's not going to be in a can, Jeffy. It would just be regular green beans. Pizza! Fine, Jeffy. I'll order pizza. Just, just continue watching the animal planet. All right, Daddy. The hippo is the second largest animal on Earth. The first largest is your mother. All right, Jeffy, I just ordered the pizza. <laughs> what if I For a second there, I thought it actually was like an actual narrator from the animal planet. And if it is, I mean, he's definitely got a mouth on him. I want wings. You're not getting wings. I already ordered and I only got pizza. Wings. You're not getting wings, Jeffy. Wings. What's that? That can't be the pizza. That was way too fast. Well, Dad, can I enter the door? <sighs> Fine, Jeffy. Here's five dollars. Oh, you're gonna pay me to go get my pizza? Wait, no, no, Jeffy, that's for the pizza man. I am. Wait, 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 what? Did, did they already pay for the pizza? And then you, is a five dollars a tip, or is five dollars the tip and the pizza combined? Because I don't understand how you, a pizza delivery costs five dollars only. I am the pizza man, Daddy. I eat the pizza, and so they call me the pizza man. No, no, no Jeffy, Jeffy, no. Whoever's at the door, you give them that five dollars, okay? <sighs> Fine, Daddy. <sighs> Hello? Oh, an alien! Oh, 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 you want me to be quiet? Oh, well, here's five bucks. <laughs> My daddy told me to give it to you. Why don't you go get a hotel with it? A hotel for five bucks? Don't think that's gonna happen, sport. Oh, do you want to stay here? Oh, well, if you'll be really quiet, I think I have a place for you to hide. Come on. 
Okay, this hide oh, no. and don't make any noise, okay? Hey, Daddy, we're hippo. What? We're hippo. Hippo there. We're pizza. Who? Why are they talking like cavemen? Where's the pizza? What pizza? The pizza that was at the door, Jeffy. There wasn't a pizza at the door. Then who was at the door? SpongeBob. No, Patrick. Wait, Squidward, final answer. Squidward was not at the door, Jeffy. Who was at the door? I mean, Squidward does look closest to the alien out of the three characters he picked. Door! Squidward! What? Oh, great. One of the light bulbs went out. Let me just go get the ladder. Wait, the ladder? Okay. Okay, let me get this ladder. Oh, man, who's at the door? Man, Mr. Squidward, that was close. We gotta find somewhere else for you to hide. So he does look like Squidward, right? Follow me! Except without the big nose. Hey there, I got a pizza for you. Whoa, whoa, I don't know what's in this thing. Uh, I'm just kidding, it's a pizza. I just like to keep things fun. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't have a tip for you. My son took your tip money. Oh, okay. What? What? There you go. What? Why? Why would you do that? That's such a waste of good food. And it looked fresh. It actually looked freaking fresh. It didn't look like it was a day old or something. It looked like they just got it. Oh. Oh, this is, this is so sad. Yeah, thanks for the tip. <laughs> Enjoy your pizza. Why would you do that? <laughs> oh, I wish I could do that, but I need this job. Oh, okay. I guess it was just um, a vision of what he wanted to do. So no tip, huh? No. All right, here's your pizza. Sorry. Yeah. All right, Mr. Squidward, I got another place for you to hide. Underneath this couch cushion. Oh, you can fit? Come on! Jeffy, the pizza's here! Oh, oh no! My daddy's coming! We gotta find another place for you to hide! Maybe behind the couch. No one ever goes there. You turned into me? Jeffy! Oh, we gotta hide! My daddy's coming! Now, that is weird. Jeffy, that is so there's weird. pizza downstairs! But Jeffy! Why do you look like that? You don't... <laughs> it looks so freaking weird, man. How did they make this? I mean, it looks weird, but it looks well done. How do they make this? It don't look so good, Jeffy. Are you feeling sick? Jeffy, you answer me when I'm talking to you. <laughs> Jeffy, speak. <laughs> Jeffy, don't raise your voice at me. <laughs> Jeffy, stop. <laughs> Jeffy. <laughs> oh, Jeffy, like, come on, it's time to go eat. <laughs> I nailed that imp impersonation. <gasps> my guy thinks that's me? Oh, well, well, now I don't have to go to school or do my chores or anything. I'm gonna go sit in the closet and play Minecraft. All right, Jeffy, here's the pizza you wanted. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, pizza. <laughs> All right, Jeffy. <laughs> now I'm in. Eat it. <laughs> Jeffy, you just threw up all over your pizza. Are you sick? Well, he's definitely mentally ill. Oh, Jeffy, I know what you're doing. You're trying to fake being sick so you don't have to go to school tomorrow. You're still going to school tomorrow. This is insane, and I love it. <laughs> Jeffy, go to bed. <sighs> Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Jeffy, wake up. It's time to go to school. Jeffy, it's time to go to school. <laughs> Jeffy, stop it. You're not faking sick, so you don't have to go to school. You're going to school, okay? Go to school, Jeffy. Wait, Mario can't tell that. He's just not saying any words. Like, Jeffy can speak, although he makes a lot of weird sounds. He can say words. This Jeffy cannot. And I guess Mario just can't tell the difference. <laughs> go to school. <sighs> All right, class. Today we're gonna be learning about aliens. There are two types of aliens: little green guys who fly around in spaceships, and hmm, you know, like run, run, run. run. <laughs> I just got it. <laughs> Freaking <laughs> the wall. Run, run. Arriba! You know, Canadians. Any questions, class? Canadians. Beach black. You look like an alien because of how ugly you are. Black. What are you looking at, you bug-eyed freak? <laughs> Oh, that'll teach him. Jeffy, why you throw up on other student? Crass, if you sick, you gotta go to the bathroom. Jeffy, go to the nurse's office right now. Wait, where did Bully Bill go? Did he get disintegrated or something? He wasn't there. It was just like the the sick. He wasn't there. School? Why is Jeffy school calling me? Hope everything's okay. <laughs> Hello? Hello! This is school nurse. My name is Chiquita, like the banana. Okay. What? 
Hey, uh, is Jeffy all right? No, your baby's sick. He throwing up green stuff and his thumb fell off. What? His thumb fell off? Is he? Oh, thumb. I thought, <laughs> I thought she said thong. I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> what? Why is Jeffy wearing that? Is it alive? Oh, hold on, baby. Let me check his hot beeps. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Nah, baby, he sleep. Sleep? What do you mean he sleep? Well, he ain't got no heart beeps, but he's still breathing, though. I think you should come pick him up and take him home. Okay, I'll be there soon. <laughs> I see you soon. That's your daddy. He come and pick you up. My goodness. Ah. <laughs> uh. That was pretty edgy. <laughs> Jeffy, I can't believe your thumb came off at school today. You're not in any pain? I guess you really are sick. <laughs> Who's that? Oh, you're staring here, Jeffy. Yeah. Uh, hello? Oh, hey there. Oh, the cops. Oh, the cops. Okay, yeah, it's such a harsh term. Okay, how about officer? Huh? How about that? What do you want, officer? That's better. I could have been worse. You could have said the pigs. <laughs> All right, now you heard about the alien that broke out of Area 51? Oh yeah, I saw it on the news. Yeah, well this tracker here on my phone says he's at your house. What? He's not here. Well, I believe the tracker more than I believe you, because you don't tip when I deliver you pizzas. Well, I haven't seen an alien in my house. Well, I have probable cause, so that means I get to come in and mess up your house looking for him. Well, please don't mess it up. Can you do it, like, really neat? I will promise no such thing. See, look, there's no aliens in here. Just my son and my son's thumb that fell off. What, your son's thumb fell off? Yeah. And that didn't seem weird to you? No, people's thumbs fall off all the time. No, they don't. No, they don't. No, no, they really don't. They don't? No! Well, well, he's not in any pain. Well, that's even weirder. If your thumb falls off, it should probably hurt a lot. Well, maybe Jeffy doesn't feel a lot of pain. Okay, look, sometimes aliens can morph into people to disguise themselves. And the tracker on my phone says the alien is definitely somewhere inside your house. So I'm... What's Jeff? Oh yeah, Jeffy's in the closet. Like, what's what's Jeffy doing? I'm thinking the alien just morphed into your son to hide himself. Well, look, I know that's my son. I know Jeffy. That's a hundred percent Jeffy. What are you talking about? It doesn't even look like him. He's all pale, and his eyes are all bugged out, and he's got a big nose. Jeffy always looks like that. What? No, he doesn't. O okay, look, I have a test that can definitely prove if he's an alien or not. Okay, give him the test then. It's the alien test. Everyone who comes into the United States has to pass this test. <laughs> I think that's the wrong test, buddy. All right, all right. First question. Who is the current president of the United States? Poop. Poop. Well, he's not completely wrong. Okay, next question. <laughs> what year was the Declaration of Independence signed? How is he supposed to know that? Are you kidding me? Everybody knows that. Well, I don't even know the answer. Well, take a guess. Uh, 1942? 1942? No! I should be giving you this test. That's completely wrong. <laughs> 1940s. Yeah, right before uh, World War II, they signed the Declaration of Independence. When was it signed? 1776. What, that long ago? Yeah, that long ago. Okay, give him another question. Okay, last question. Jeffy, are you an alien? Yep. What? He, he didn't say yup. He, he, he didn't know. He meant nope. He, he doesn't know the questions you're asking. It's stupid. Jeffy, we don't have time for this. Let's get out of here. Ah! Did your son just come apart at the waist? Yeah! What is he, Darth Maul? I feel like I'm at a Chris Angel show! What, Jeffy, what, <laughs> that, that didn't hurt? Yeah, he did, dude. No, he seems fine. Uh, I think he might be an alien. Yeah, you think? Oh, okay, okay, how, how do we know if he's an alien or not? Okay, well, I mean, he just lost the bottom part of his body. That's a pretty good sign. And he's still functioning normally. That's a really good sign, I, I would say. Well, everybody knows that aliens hate water. So, all you gotta do is just squirt him a few times with a spray bottle and he'll lose his disguise. Oh, do it. All right. Yeah, yeah. Aha! I knew he was the alien! I would've never noticed! Yeah, because you're blind. You would've clapped your cheeks and you never would've seen it coming. Alright, alien, <laughs> we're going back to Area 51. Now, uh, here, you, you cuff yourself. I don't really feel like doing it. Alright, I'm taking- What a weird- what a weird episode. Uh, yeah, what are you talking about? He's a dangerous alien. He melted a kid at school today with his acid- So he did get rid of B Bully Bill. Because I, I was wondering, when it showed- it was just the acid that was there, and not actually Bully Bill. Like, well, where'd he go? Puke. Yeah, I guess he is pretty dangerous. Yeah, alright, come on, alien, we're going back. Yeah, yeah, all that. <laughs> <sighs> Today's been a weird day. Hey, Donnie! No kidding. Oh, where Jeffy? Jeffy here. Where Hippo? N no, where Jeffy been? In your closet playing Minecraft? Where Hippo? I, I don't know where Hippo. Dare Hippo. Jeffy came out of the closet. Uh, if you have a pet alien, what would you make it do? I I, I don't know. I don't know. <coughs>
anyway, I hope you guys like this video. <laughs> I actually really like this episode. It was very silly. And, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed it. Mario is really oblivious to, like, everything that goes on in his life. Like, it's very easy to tell that Jeffy wasn't Jeffy. He, he looked totally different. He couldn't really even form normal words. All he would do is like that. It was, it was weird, but uh, I enjoyed this. I hope you guys did as well. I think I'd rate this SML video out of a 10. I don't know, probably like a 7.9. I, I really liked it. I hope you guys did too. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up if you're new and subscribe to the family. Make sure you guys also go subscribe to Super Bowser Logan. Links in the description. And uh, yeah, with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Boop.